see from the title of the video we are going to be doing an unboxing of a Mavic Air 2 fly more combo kit and I'm super excited just got this in been sitting on it for about a week waiting to do this video and we're just gonna take it out of the box and see what comes with it and do a quick uh, review of it and then this also what I love about the Air 2 is it comes with the ADS-B air sense which will let you know when manned aircraft are in the area, but let's go ahead. I already got the plastic off, so we're going to go ahead and open this up and see what comes in the box. Now, I know a lot of people have done reviews, and they've looked at these cases, and they really like them, but I don't really like the DJI cases because I don't like soft cases, and I bought a hard case. I'll be doing a three-part video for this drone. Um that has, I'll be doing a video of a case and a video of all the accessories that I would buy and recommend for your drone. So we're gonna see what's in the first box. I kinda already know what's in these because I've watched unboxings of other people's uh, Air 2s. And in this box, you get a pack of propellers A-side. Let's go and see if we can get this out. And let's see, a bunch of manuals. And your B-side propellers, you get a set of three. That's all that's in that box. I'll put that off to the side. I don't, I mean, if you're new to flying, you can definitely read through these manuals. But honestly, the best way to learn anything about drones is just watch YouTube. There's plenty of videos online that will sh guys will show you different ways of flying and how to do certain things with your drone. You'll learn better hands-on with them than actually reading those manuals. So let's go ahead and get into the box here. I'm going to put that to the side because there's nothing else in it. Now you do have a front pocket here, but like I said, I don't really like these cases because, I mean, I just feel like it's pushing up against the drone if I put anything in that pocket. So, I'd, like I said, I'll be doing a video of a better case that I'd recommend buying. I'm going to go ahead and get this open. All right, so what comes in the bag is, we'll go ahead and put that box aside and we'll go through it once I go and get everything pulled out of here so we can just show you everything that it comes with. And then up in this pocket here should be all your little accessories and everything that comes with it. And that's pretty much all that comes in the bag, nothing else. These silicon packs don't need those. All right, let's throw that off to the side. All right, so let's start off. Of course, you got your propellers A and B side, and it'll tell you on the drone if you don't, if you're new to drones and you don't understand that, um, you have to put them across from each other. Otherwise, your drone will do all kinds of crazy stuff when you go to turn it on. And then here, get this open is your multi-charger. Now it doesn't charge all three batteries at once, it charges one at a time and it starts with whatever battery has the most charge, that way you can get flying as quick as possible. And you'd put one, two, three, and then you plug it into the charging, um, the charging box there. Let's put that up there. Go ahead and open this pack up. This should be the ND filters. Yes, it is. And you have an ND16, ND64, and an ND256. Really nice. Because those alone would be about $50 if you bought them alone. That's why I recommend buying the Fly More combo. Um, a lot of these combos that you buy you get a bunch of extras in that you wouldn't get with the, just buying the drone by itself. And it's only about $180 more than what it costs to just buy the Fly More combo. Okay, and here is a battery bank. And I will show you, as soon as I we get that box open, I'll show you what that goes to. 
And then in this bag, you have your extra joysticks. This is a charging cable for your remote control. And these are obviously the cables that go from your phone to the controller, but I'm not gonna be needing either one of this because this is, or either one of these. This is USB-C to micro USB and USB-C to USB-C, and I don't need either one of those. Put that out there. Set those there. And we'll go ahead and open the controller up. Okay, and then you have your extra joysticks down here, or your extra ones here, but uh, the case that I bought, you'll be able to leave the joysticks in and I don't have to take them out every single time. It's got a cutout for them and it doesn't put any pressure on the joysticks. So I can put the ones that came as extras in here and then I can leave the other ones in storage down here. They just pop in and out like that. Pretty much the same design as the DJI Mini. I'll show you that controller as a comparison. That's the old controller, and this is the new one. The joysticks just go down in here like this. But the case I have for the Mini, uh, I still have to take the joysticks out. A much different controller design, which I like. It has the foam mount on the top instead of the bottom. Let's see here. Like that. And the antennas are built on the inside of the foam mount. But I also, in my accessories video, I'll be showing you a different mount that I'll be using that goes in there. All right, let's see what comes in the box. Now this comes with three batteries and a fly more combo. Like I said, these batteries are 100 and I want to say the average between 100 to 115 a piece. Um, so definitely get the fly more combo because if you buy the regular drone, it only comes with one battery. And like I said, for $180 more, you get two extra batteries. You get the power bank. You get two extra sets of propellers. Uh, and you get the ND filters. You get the multi-charger. You get so much more by buying the fly more combo power brick nothing special there and that's it for that box I'll go ahead and open these batteries up can't wait to get this thing into the air you get like I said you get three batteries one two and three I'll go ahead and take a little bit of look at the drone now there's stickers everywhere on this thing DJI loves stickers. All right, so I'm going to pop those, that one off. Let's see here, and this should be the camera. And this shoots 4K and 60 frame, which is actually better than the Mavic Pro, which is kind of funny since the Mavic Pro costs almost double what this one costs. So I was glad when I decided to get this one over the Mavic Pro. And everybody I know on YouTube that I talk to on a regular that has uh, drone videos, they all tell me the same thing. They said this is the, one of the best drones out there. So I'm super excited to get this in the air. Sticker there. There's stickers all over this thing. That there. And you see your three axis gimbal completely steady in the in the air when the wind's blowing. You got side A and side B. Fold it out like that. Sticker there. One there, and one up here on the top of the battery. I don't need any of these. I know what to do with this thing. I have other DJI drones, so this is pretty much the same as the Mini, just a lot larger. Battery, 
and give you a little com size comparison of the mini. And the mini has been a great drone. I love that thing. So this is going to be a great little addition to my collection. We'll go over the drone a little bit. You have the bottom sensors. You have your uh, landing light, your back sensors, your front sensors, and that will be all for obstacle avoidance so it doesn't hit anything. Like I said, it's got the ADS-B AirSense technology, which is the only Mavic drone that has it. And that will let you know when there's any kind of manned aircraft anywhere in your area. Um, unfortunately, it's still kind of in its infancy, so it doesn't really tell you how far up they are or exactly their location. It just kind of lets you know, hey, they're nearby, be careful. So you got to pay attention to that. But that was a quick unboxing. And like I said, I'll be doing a three-part episode of... For this drone, one will be the unboxing, two will be accessories, and one will be for the case. So uh, thanks for sticking around, and uh, be posting the other videos coming up this next week. Thanks. See you guys soon.